Hey everybody, it's actually in the last episode. We escaped Moonside and defeated the evil main main statue that was actually a device of Dark Illusions that was making us wander around a warehouse in the back of Jackie's Cafe. And we were presented by, we were met by um, a guy who was meant to deliver us the trout flavored yogurt dispenser. But he did not accomplish his mission and he dropped it in the desert. So we're gonna have to look for it in Monkey's Cave. Probably the worst dungeon that is in this game. Well, the one reason why, at the end of my let's play, I'll probably end up giving Earthbound 9.5 out of 10. This one dungeon ruins the game for me. Now, if you're asking me why I sound so glum and gloomy right now, it's because I have to do it all over again, and because my recorder decided to stop at the right at the end of the video. As soon as I was going to start resuming the video, it decided to stop the video right at the, directly at the end of the dungeon that we're about to do, and for give me the option to either uh, record a five-second video and upload that five second video which will last the uploading of that five second video will probably last more than 12 hours because you know how YouTube is and now I have to do this whole dungeon over again because it, my, my camera decided to shut off on me for no apparent reason so we're going to do this dungeon and Hopefully everything will be Gucci enough from there. Now, this dungeon consists of giving, exchanging, and trading with monkeys. And it's probably the worst thing that they could ever put in such a great game. But we gotta do it anyways. Because it gives us something pretty good at the end. No, we don't have a fresh egg. We'll get that later. No, we don't have the rule yet either, so we need to turn back and get it. for this dungeon and it really is aggravating me because it's very simple don't get me wrong it's simple and easy to do it's the fact that we have to do it and I, I have to do it again so hopefully I can do this dungeon without any mess ups without any mishappenings let's do it flame pendant, the only perfectly useful item in this dungeon.
right, this guy will give us um, fresh eggs. And I'm going to ask him for quite a few, only because fresh eggs hatch into chickens and we'll need to have them just so we won't have to bother with going back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. So we got three, hopefully they don't all hatch at the same exact time. Let's go to the other part of the dungeon that we have yet done, to done yet. I like this one. He, he's not gonna be an idiot. He'll just ask me for a hamburger. Of course, I don't have a hamburger for some reason. Why don't I have a hamburger? Please, mow out the way. Don't have one there. fresh egg and we did it on time so there were just a bunch of chickens in my pocket got a neutralizer So let's go to that monkey who called us a tightwad before. Make his day happy. Uh, that's the neutralizer room. Yes, the only reason why I didn't skip the recording of this dungeon is because I want to make sure this is a great walkthrough. This is for my, the people who are watching me. Because I care about my subscribers and I like my viewers. I'm glad that they watch me. Because honestly, I could just be posting videos right now and they could be absolutely nothing. No views, no likes, no anything. I like you guys a lot and I really am glad that you guys are watching my videos. It may not sound like it right now, but that's because I'm in the worst dungeon I've ever possibly created. But it's just the fact of the matter is that I'm glad that you guys subscribed to me. Despite my below average recording technology on me. Hopefully, for some weird reason, a pencil shaped iron statue is blocking the path. We will be able to escape this dungeon without anything. Bullshit. Alright. Alright, I've been waiting for you. That's good for you. Instead of talking to the mystical man in front of us, we're going to take his brain food lunch that he was probably going to eat for, uh, for lunch today and your cup of noodles. 
Then we'll talk to you. The truth of space and time moves through the universe like a wave. Truth speaks through space and matter and makes itself known to the human being. I was waiting for you and you came. This was destined to happen. In truth, all is predetermined. Ness, Allah, Jeff, and Pooh. When these four powers gather, Twisted Space will bring back peace to the world. Do you understand? It doesn't matter. Proceed as you wish. Over in the treasure box and take what is beside with you. Uh, I already did that. Did you come and search for Opus? Someone left it behind in this hole. You cannot carry anything else while you get rid of something you don't need. You'll need this, the gourmet yoga machine. Let's throw a chick away. Oh, you're gonna say it all over again. Time and space. Space and time. Do you understand? It doesn't matter. Take a look this. Is. Oh, you already took my treasure box stuff? Okay. Someone left this behind. Thank you. Jack got the Uber dispenser. The adventure that lies ahead of it won't be easy. I'll give you a special kill to help you move through space as you wish. Learn the skill from the monkey over there. Would you like to learn the special power? What if I said no? <laughs> ha ha ha, that's wonderful. Speak to the monkey over there. I'll teach you teleportation. Let's go outside. You're not gonna make me walk outside, are you? Guys, I'll be right back. Worst dungeon ever! Follow me, like this way. Oh, we were attacked first. Mr. Monkey, can you help us? Oh, no, we're good, my bad. Alright, all right, let's keep going. Okay, I'll do a teacher's demonstration. You can learn this, you can go anywhere you've been previously. You can go there instantly. This skill can't be used in a room or dungeon, though. I went to Foresight and returned. I showed you the basic straight course. You can build up enough speed while turning if you have enough room. Okay, why don't you try it, young man? Let's learn how to use PSI teleportation. Great. Okay, the teacher's going home now. Huh, <sighs> that'd be great. And with one last try, we are going to zoom. Actually, no, we won't zoom. We will, in fact, try out the teleportation and see just how it works. It only costs for 2 PP. Where will we go? Let's go to Honor. Twosome, Greed, Salary Valley, and Winters. But we can go to Foresight instead. Let's do it. And that's how it's done. Now that we're back in Foresight, in the next episode, I will leave it off here. In the next episode, we are going to Go find Mrs. What's it? Yeah, what's her name? Uh, I forgot. Maybe I'll find it right now. Yeah. Yeah, but with teleportation, all you need is a basic straight course. It can be done in a. It can be done while moving, but it's really hard, and I probably never gonna do it while moving. But let's speak to her. I kept asking around for trial flavor yogurt, but what? You had the tro the yogurt dispenser? May I have it? Before you can answer, she took the yogurt dispenser. Now I can make trap flavor yogurt for my guests. You are so kind, I'll make some for you. My room's on the 48th floor. Don't forget to drop by. My room's on the 48th floor. Don't forget to drop by. You said that. Alright, and with that, we are done. Next time on Earthbound, we will enter Monotoli's building. And hopefully, we'll find Paula. See you guys next time. Goodbye.